we were very happy when e-cigarettes first came out because we were trying to get our smokers off of cigarettes. We used this as an alternative. We gave them nicotine replacement in this, and many patients felt like they were smoking cigarettes, smoked a lot less or not at all, and we were happy that this was a real alternative. So what this has turned into is very unfortunate for us because it was a harm reduction that has now turned into this unknown. So we can't in good conscience say that it's okay to use just nicotine replacement products because we don't even know if those are safe. The theory is that the unregulated THC mixed products are likely the biggest culprit, but we have patients who claim they have not done those and are still sick. So I don't think we have the full answer as to what's going on. And some people think it's the flavor and some people think it's the oil that it's mixed in. The, the lung biopsies have given us different results for different patients, so we don't have a clear, consistent answer from that either. So until we know better, I can't say that it's a harm reduction. Die Entzündungen, unter denen die Lungenflügel von Ivali-Patienten leiden, sind auf den Röntgenbildern und Computertomographien für die Lungenfachärztin gut erkennbar. You can see that there's a breathing tube here in the right uh, and here the lungs should be nice and black like this up here and uh, I can see by looking at this that the lungs are not filled with air which is what they should be instead they're filled with this dense material that should not be there. 